How's it going, everybody? Moto the Joe here, and today we are back with another episode of Windbound. So, um, last episode I realized that my microphone audio was turned so high up, and I do uh, I do apologize for that. Because now I should have it at the proper. Uh, at the proper level so now you guys should be able to hear this better and hear me just as good because i rewatched uh i watched part of my video to like make sure it was okay as in audio quality wise and everything because I, I do that sometimes and ooh, the war chapter three and pretty much uh i realized that my commentary was a little loud so you know i mean i fixed it and i realized too you guys couldn't see my health bar and you guys can see a lot of things so I fixed it now to where you guys should be able to see all this stuff. All right, so now let's try not to fall off this hill. Ouch! Sorry, Kara. All righty, so we need to eat something. All right. So we're gonna have to get. Did I not? Am I gonna get poisoned if I eat this? All right, nice. Found us some mushrooms. Actually, don't kill us. Well, that is a first in a survival game. Oh, some berries. All right, so. Obviously, the goal for this one is we're going to go and find the next. What the hell's that noise? Oh, yeah, it's this little guy. Let's pick the berries. So let's see what we can find and then we'll make a move on to the next. Um, I guess the next area. So where is my boat that's the real question other side of the island okay now what supplies do i have okay i got bow got some berries got bamboo okay yeah the whole sailing physics on this game is pretty hard um because i don't understand it too well that's yeah i mean that's my fault but I'm going to um oh no more berries. Cool, so these should be able to help us a little bit. So we're going to go and just search for the next stuff that we can, go to the next island. I think I see it. So why no, push. Okay, row. All right, I have to make a turn. Oh no! Don't run into the rock. Wow, I, I am terrible. And see, when you do stuff like that, is when your bow actually gets damaged. So, so all right, let's try and. Ooh, it's a storm. So we are going to go to one of these next areas. I thought I saw that big yellow place. There's like a big, um, how you say it? Like if you saw the last episode, there is a, uh, how do you, there's like this, um, I guess like a temple or like a, a place like that, that shows where, there it is. There's one, there's one up there. Ah, the nice music. So normally, let's see. Yeah, that's what I mean. These things make you go pretty far sometimes. So we're going to go to this one, like this one, and then we're going to try to find the third one. This, These episodes might end up being a lot shorter than I thought because um, I do play for quite a bit on here, but a lot of the stuff is just... 
I mean, if this is the point of the game to get to these things and all that, then I'm gonna get these as fast as I can. And then go and discover and walk around on my, uh, pretty much on my spare time. And go and discover other things, you know? Ah, there it is. Nice. Oh, if you guys can see, there's a thing out in the distance over there. It looks like eyes looking over the cliff. That's the next thing we're gonna go to after this. So, oh no, she lost hunger. Good thing I picked those koji berries. I really wonder if you can do a pacifist playthrough on this. Like, no fighting, no nothing. But then at the same time, you would need meat, you would need all that stuff like that. So, I don't know. It would be really nice to actually maybe try that. So, it's alright. Alright. Let's fall off another mountain. Alright, you can make the jump. Are you kidding me? You can't jump to right there, but you can... Oh my god. Kara, your climbing skills are ass. Like total cheeks. Oh, we should go jump up that. There we go. Another one. So this should be the second one. I love the way this game looks. Looks so much like Zelda. Blood oozes from the cracks in the shell. The course has changed. So we have one more of the... Oh. Yeah, see, they light up into the sky. And if I go to this... Our next area that we're going to is that... Uh, it's kind of over the mountain, like I said. And we should be able to find the next... Uh, the last totem. Alright, there's some mushrooms here. Let's eat these. Rust caps. So do all the trees have these, or is this like a, just a good little spot that has some? Oh, nice. There's actually quite a few. Okay, let me see if I have anything I can drop. The plane stalker horns. I still don't know what to do with them. Same thing with the gore horn crest. You can make other stuff with them or other weapons or like other things like that. I'm sorry, I have my controller in my face. When I do thinking, I'm just like, hmm. And I don't know. I've never used anything for these. And I can kill these pretty easy. So I think I'm just going to drop them. And we're going to get us some of these rust caps. Because I think that would be good to carry a few. And it should help us. Get some grass. Gotta get sticks. I'm just gonna take all the resources I can from this island and then we're gonna go. So I got seven sticks. Okay, I'm not gonna get the palm fronds. I don't think I can hold them. Can I hold palm fronds? Yeah, no, see? I can't hold palm fronds now. So our next area is... Where am I boat at? Okay, so we're coming... From that direction, I was coming straight. So I believe... Alright, so I believe... Should go this way. It's like games where you work on your way. Coach Bear has degraded... What? Hold on. Are you freaking serious? Wow, I can't believe that. The Koji Berry. How are berries gonna degrade that fast? That wasn't even like 10 minutes or anything. That was literally like. Yeah, I'm not even that long into my video. Those things didn't even. That was terrible. Alright, so the next spot we're going to go. After this. Ooh, pretty purple flowers. Those are pretty nice trees. Jump up the thing. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Mm. oh, 
she almost fell. Nice, this should be the last one and we should be able to go and... Yeah, I think it's going to be a quick little episode. Which is nothing wrong with it, you know what I mean? I like... Sometimes the games go, Spirits of the Underworld emerge to haunt us. What are we fighting for? That's a really nice tree. I like that tree. That's like on uh, Shrek. Remember when Shrek and Donkey first meet? He's off. That's a boda. That's a really nice boda. Alright, come on. Get off. There you go. No. Come on. Jesus. She makes me so angry. Oh, it's a rock. I was like, what's right there? How are you hungry from just walking around? I just fed you. This girl gets hungry so fast, man. It's like not even funny. Uh, These things are going to expire by the time I even use them. That's stupid. Why can't I even hold them for like more than 20 minutes? Come on, Kiddos of Windbound. You guys can fix this. You guys know what to do. Push that way. Thank you. All right, so now let's go to the last whatever. All right. Let's eat some rotting. Mushrooms. Let's say, is it really not going to make my hunger grow up? Because she's like, no, you can't run while you eat. Awesome. So, yeah, this is going to be a quick little... Run up the damn thing. Yeah, and look how fast her stamina goes. That's the one thing I do not like about it. Is the stamina on this game is just terrible. Like, I can go up this right here and her stamina bar is probably going to be almost gone. Yeah, look it. Almost. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six of those little things. So, or five and a half. So, I mean, it literally wasted three and a half. So, almost half of her stamina just to run up a flight of flat stairs. No, watch it. Watch it. Yeah, look at this. Why is her stamina so bad? There better be something for me to get. Then look how, like, at least it recharges fast, but it's just, it goes way too quick. Like, I'm sure I could run up those damn stairs without losing my stamina as fast as she can. Oh, here we go. We're gonna see the ancient, the ancient jellyfish again. Oh, another story. So see, so there's two more of these. So jellyfish is setting the world on fire. Oh, they're destroying the boat, so people are attacking them. Okay. Is it like an ancient civilization that sealed themselves away to seal all the jellyfish away? That's what I'm getting from here, from looking at this. Because they worship them from the sky, the third crossing covenant. 
right here and they gave them boats and also helped them other stuff like that but they also brought storms I don't know it's pretty weird on how this looks and they keep yeah it's, so it's a worshiping thing also there's no what do they do do they kill them and get their shells is that what that is they're killing them to get their shells or something and it's like for I don't know there's a weird story so far I'm not sure if I'm I think I'm piecing it together of what I think it is, but I don't know. If we're going to fight one of these giant things one one day, it's going to be awesome. All right, here we go. One of the best parts of the game. I love I love these scenes right here. These are awesome. Oh, we're about to see something really huge. It's a big jellyfish or a big whatever. It pops out the water. I wonder if it's like that or if they're trying to see if maybe I'm worthy to like present them to something. I'm going to meet somebody bigger. Oh, it goes the intense music. Oh, no, don't hit me. Do I go straight or do I go... I'm going straight, whatever. Oh, hell no. Where was he at? He was about right here, huh? I think so. Oh, my God. Yeah, I know some of these little episodes may be a little bit dull or whatever because there's not much to do on some of the things. Oh... I think the only way you can fail this is by breaking your boat. Such intense music. Yeah, this is like their battle music or whatever. It's pretty cool. Why are you jumping? Oh my god. Whoa. There has to be something messing with me. I wish I could just see it. Just see it messing with me. Just the once. I want to see him. Whatever he's doing. Or whatever it's doing. Please don't be any reefs next to me. Because last time I lost on this or I messed up was it picked me up and it dropped me onto a reef. Like one of those little... Oh my god. is pumping so hard right now it's actually really intense oh but I'm also hyped for the PS5 PlayStation 5 can't wait new God of War coming out oh man oh oh the shark where'd it go turn oh shit where'd that shark go oh turn oh man I almost messed up big time how far am I supposed okay there it is How far am I supposed to go? 
So, I mean, this game overall, it's pretty good, but it has a little bit of repetitiveness to it. You know what I mean? Which is with the whole... I mean, that's kind of what survival games are, you know what I mean? Do the same thing over and over. Oh my god, there's jellyfish. Hello, jellies. I come in peace. They're like, yeah, tell it to our leader. Hmm. More jellyfish. That's pretty much it then, right? Yeah, see, because you can't even see this map. Awesome. So, that should be that one for that one. So, another... Make offering. Sarker swift swimming to earn coral crown. Sarker raced Mother Moon's reflection across the Everclear Bay on a bay on a cloudless night. Take her blessing and swim with Sarker's grace and confidence. Significantly less stamina drained when swimming. Scurrying legs of Scuttle. When Scuttle the scheming crab enraged the gods with his endless provocative dancing, he scurred ashore to wait out the anger on dry land. Significantly less stamina drained when sprinting. About time. That is something we really need. See, up here we can choose which one we're going to use now. So we can't use more than two. Yeah, because we need Gordel's Fortitude, and that's Poison Effects. Let's see. Your stamina still goes down hella fast. I ain't fucking worth it. Your guys, the upgrades are cool and everything, but they don't make much of a... Look, it's still the same speed. There's no difference. Oh my god. At least if you guys are going to do a stamina upgrade, make it at least actually worth it. Because that didn't do nothing. Like, her stamina goes just as fast. I don't get me wrong, I still love the game, but you got the upgrades aren't the best. I want to see this one enemy. There's this thing on here called, like, a big old sandworm I've been wanting to see. I cannot wait to see that one. Yeah, so he made it. It's still a 30 minute episode. Alright, cool. It should be about that long. Come on, loading screen. But I'm pretty sure that's going to do it for this episode of Windbound, guys. If you guys like it, please like and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be playing more of this. Oh, God. Uh, let me get to another island first. Okay, let's get right here first. And then we're going to end this off. So that way I'm at least somewhere proper. Is there a damn shore to this island? About time. Cool. 
Alrighty guys, so like I said, I think that's going to do it for this episode of Windbound. If you guys like it, please like and subscribe to the channel. I know it was a little bit dull of what we were doing, but you know, the, some of the episodes may be a little short. But like I said, like and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be posting more of this next part, which be, should be part four. And yeah, um, if you guys can follow my Twitch account, my Instagram, um, and other stuff like that, I'm going to be linking them down below in the description. And as always, guys, hope you guys all have a great day, and thank you for watching.